Hey guys, okay, so we are continuing on with our equation of faces, and this is the eye that we're gonna make today. I was just filming, but my dogs just went ahead and had a conniption, so here I'm gonna go again. I'm gonna think about an almond. Um, so you know how an almond kind of goes like this, and then it goes like that, right? That is like such an almond. If I were to put lines in here, you see how that would be an almond, right? But no, we're not gonna make an almond today. So here, we're coming back in here, and we're going to come in with the top, and then we're coming into the bottom, so we have an almond. But here, what I want you to do is you're gonna come out, and you're gonna make it, see how I took it on the bottom, and then came up on top? All that was was I had line here, so I came in on the bottom, and then crisscrossed it up to the top. And then I'm gonna, uh, color that in. I have my pupil with the hint, highlight, or kapow, whichever way you want to call it. And then I'm putting in my um, iris. You know, on a iris, there's always these lines in here. If you want to get those in there, every iris has rods and cones. Um, so then in here, remember that we're going to put in, I don't know where my stump is. Um, so here, you know what we'll do? We'll do, instead of toilet paper today, we'll do the paper towel as a stump. And all I've done is wrap that paper towel around it, and then I can come in and I can blend. And then you don't even ever have to get a tortillon. And now here, this is called a kneaded eraser. And what this does is it, um, you knead it, and it kind of comes into all different shapes and sizes, but you can get a really fine edge on there and then I can come in and I can highlight and um, bring out where I want there to be um, a little bit more of a, a, a glimmer in the eye. Okay, so this is my eye. My nose, I'm just gonna come in and do a straight line for a nose. Um, I don't know, you wanna do kind of like that? What if we just did that? A nose, a line, and then a whoop, little hill. Okay, so a mouth, you know, there's only so much you can do with a mouth. The mouth is a mouth. We are not aliens and we just have a top lip and a bottom lip. So the only thing that we can start doing now is taking these, this equation of top lip darker, light bottom lip lower, and kind of exaggerating it. So let's go with a really exaggerated top lip. So that's like an M going out. And then we can come in and then we could kind of woo go really down low so you see that it's really just we're just exaggerating what we've already started okay now on the face this is what I'm gonna say we're gonna again you know there's only so many faces that you can do right so here what I'm gonna say is let's do a really round face okay and then here there's two options that we can do. We can make it so that the eyes are really far apart, or we can make it so that the eyes are, well, we're gonna do it two different ways. This one will be eyes far apart. And then here, this one will be that the eyes are really close together, okay? So we've got far apart, why? Um, far apart, close together, mouth, new nose, new, um, that new what and now we're going to do another hair so let's do we've got a lot of bangs going on right so let's do um, a face with a neck and let's do braids so if we have it kind of coming in and over in and over and then we're going to kind of have like a whoop, 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 whoop. and then we're going to do one to kind of like a rope and really I think if you do it neat and if you do it fast and then you got the little thing down there and then you know you've got these kind of coming down there so then okay so now I don't know if I made this I'm gonna give these numbers now okay so coming over here I've got one two three one two three one two three one two three four and then one two three 
Okay, get ready for this now. Remember we talked, I said the bad word. Close your ears, I'm gonna say it again. Pass. Shh, pretend I didn't say it. So look what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna take a dice and I'm going to roll the dice and I got a four. So let's go with a four. I'm going to have my, let's go with, hold on, let me see. A three. So if I look at my eyes, a three is my new eye that I just did today. That's going to be the eye I do. Completely up to chance. I'm going to do this one, this little button nose. Three, two, a one mouth. Let me write this down because I will forget. You know, this is math. Okay, so I've got three, two, one. And then I've got a two. I've got a broad face. And then hair. Two, I've got this girl. Okay, so as we're putting her all together, let's see what we got here, you ready? So I've got a number three eye, so I'm gonna come in and do an almond. And remember, we go right there, so I'm gonna start another almond here. An almond, I'm going to go Ooh, you can't see anything I'm doing, can I? I'm gonna go over and up. I'm gonna go over and up. I'm gonna color that in. So do you see how the, just as we're doing this, you've got an equation for faces. You literally have different faces as you just combine all of these different elements. So there, I've got that. Uh, ooh, that one looked like she was just drinking just a little tad bit. Okay, here. Okay, I'm gonna come in here. Remember, we gotta shade in a little bit. We gotta shade in a little bit. See, and this serves then as her eyelashes. We had a two nose, which was the little button. So I'm gonna give her a little bit of an eye lid. And then I'm gonna give her, and we're gonna do a button. And then remember, we did a round and we did a round. And then I've got a number one lip, you see? One lip had the house. Remember we had the upside down house? And then we're gonna go out and out, remember? We're gonna go over, whoop, there's that thing. And then we're gonna come down, down, over. We're gonna put the lip in dark. Three, two, one, two. We had a wide face. So here, I've gotta go wide face. I'm going to come around woo, up here. Okay, and then we're going to give her a cute little neck. And then I've got the hair. I kind of do not like, I feel like she might look just a little bit like a um, alien. So I'm going to try to just not make her look so much like an alien because that was just a little bit unsettling. I think I might have nightmares tonight because of that. We're going to give her an ear. We're going to give her an ear. You know, ears always um, help you get over the whole uh, alien look. Oh, see, now isn't that sweet? She needed a chin. Poor little thing didn't have a chin. Now she's got a chin. Okay, so I'm coming down. I'm coming down. I'm going to give her her cutesy patootie little... Who's he watch this down there? Okay, now her hair was a two, which is the bangs and the bangs. Oh, Lord have mercy, the child needs a, and the bangs, and then she's got her hair coming down like this. So I have, oh, she needs just a little bit down over here, over her ears. So my equation of faces, the whole premise behind the equation of faces is that you can just mix and match all the different elements. Use a, use a dice. Um, eventually we'll have six of each. Um, let's see if I can't just make some more here. So I've got this eye. How many minutes am I at? I am at um, nine minutes. Okay, so let's see. How about we've got this one, this one, this one. How about if we just make sort of a, now I'm just playing. I did not plan this out. So we're just gonna, I do feel like you have to give them just a little bit of an eyelash. And then we do this and we do this. Okay, so that can be four. Um, 
And then again, oh, see, look, now I can take my um, kneaded eraser and just kind of pop out a little bit of that. Okay, um, so that gives you four. Another nose. Um, so let's see. Same idea as this one, except you're going to give two little nostrils right there. So you're just coming down and then two little nostrils. So that gives you four, four, four faces. Hmm. So how about another lip? We've got an exaggerated upper lip. What about if we went with a thin upper lip, but then a really thick lower lip so that we've got it both ways? Okay, so that's four. Um, we've got four faces. I've got this hair. All right, let's do another hair. One more hair. Um, what do we got? What do we got? What do we got? Um, how about if we kind of do like a curly kind of thing? Um, so curly is kind of curly is just a crazy, crazy kind of thing. If you just kind of get in there and sort of make all those curls come out. Look at how cute she is. Can you even stand it? Okay, number four. Curly, curly, curly. So that equation of faces gives you four of everything roll your dice take your dice roll them and well don't get a six though you got to get a one through four um and then do your eyes your nose your mouth your head shape and your hair and just mix and match and just keep on going you've got i don't know somebody that can do statistics and can figure that and has a much bigger great brain than i has there's lots of combinations here so that's all i got for right now this week we've got a busy week we've got the equation of faces we're going to have how to paint a face and we're going to start doing some writing so lots doing um have a great day bye